Hey! Hey, yo, what's poppin'? Party people, I'm that one dude, Chris from YouTube, and welcome to the Plucky Squire! This is also another one of those games that I've had my eye on for a while now. When I first saw the trailer for this game, I immediately fell in love with it due to the fact that it messes around with a mix of 2D, 3D art style. So there's points in the game where you will be roaming around the, the environment in like a, a 3D art style. And it's like you, it, it just looks so good. Sometimes you'll be running in like a, a 2D, I don't even know how to explain it. If you haven't seen the trailer, if you haven't seen anything about this, then you are in for a treat because this game looks like a good time. It looks like it's got that mix of like different video game elements and video game genres, but is also its own video game itself. It's it, It's got a lot of video game references, but it has its own charm. So without further ado, no time wasted. Let's hop right into this shit. Oh, do we want adventure mode or do we want story mode? If you're feeling plucky and you want to challenge, this mode is for you. A breezy way to play. Relax and enjoy the story of a plucky squire. Ooh. I like, I like a good challenge, you know? Like, story mode will be nice and all, but, but we're here to play a game, right? We're here to enjoy a story and play a game. So, adventure mode, obviously. Am I going to regret this later? <laughs> Probably. And this looks good. Once upon a time, there was a plucky squire named Jot. Jot lived in the land of Mojo, a land of creativity. Mojo Dojo Casa House. Mojo was ruled by the gentle queen, Chroma. He defended the land from the nefarious sorcerer, Hum Grubble. Which everyone very much appreciated. Good lad. Well done. Racky. Jot was also a writer and okay, would transcribe Jot. his many adventures in book form. Okay, Jot. These tales were avidly read by all the people of the land, who found them quite gripping. Jot awoke one fine morning and pluckily leapt from his bed. From afar, he could hear some rather exciting music. He got dressed and went to investigate. Chapter 1 Ooh. Some Serious Beeswax This is me! This is me! Okay, I I didn't get any instructions on how to play, but I'm sure they'll tell me. The music was really booming. This was the house of the good wizard, Moonbeard. Do we got a DJ wizard? Ah, jot my lap. He exclaimed. I'm on a roll here, traveling to new musical realms. Since you're here, lad, I have a small favor to ask. What's good? <laughs> wax. I need more wax, lad. To press more records, you know. Oh, I know exactly what you mean. Listen, I've been collecting vinyls all Would year. You go to Honey Peak and get some wax from Benny B. I've been collecting them records. Pip here will accompany you. I might need one for this game. A mini quest, woohoo! You take care of the goblins and I'll haul the wax back here for you. Oh yeah, there'll be goblins. <laughs> Thanks, Pip. No sweat for you though, right, Jot? The entrance to the woods beckoned. Can I interact with any of the trees? You know me. I'm looking for, I'm not a completionist, but I'll look for them collectibles. 
Are you hearing this, lad? I reckon it could be a scooch louder. All, bo all aboard the Moonbeam Express. Destination, Dead City. <laughs> Hell yeah. Ah, that's how I use it. Okay, cool. Woo! Oh, okay. Okay, so I could go back and see if I can do anything with these trees. Oh, this is so fire. I really hate that I say that every time I play a game. It's like, do I actually think it... No, I genuinely think it's fire, but you guys might think I'm like just saying that because I say it every time. I would not say it if I didn't actually think it. If I didn't think that this game was not fun or was not fire, it wouldn't get my appraisal at all. I mean, not in the way that I give it. Shut up, Chris. Oh, there's combo attacks too. Ha! I feel like I'm playing... <laughs> I feel like I'm playing like a, a Legend of Zelda type thing. Like Jot is the silent protagonist. Goblins ahead! What is that? Oh! Left shift. Interesting. Ooh! I got a roll button! I'm on a roll! No? Hey? Hey? Oh yeah, this game is about to be a breeze. This game is easy. I'm playing on easy mode right now. Jot, that's not the way to Honey Peak. Oh, okay. To the Tome Tower. And I don't have a stamina bar? It's over. <laughs> Are you hearing this lad? I reckon it'd be a scooch ladder all aboard the... Uh, okay. Do we not... Oh, I didn't see this entrance up here. The gate swung open for the plucky squire. Thank you, gate! May I just ask, what are these light bulbs that I'm collecting? This isn't the... What is it that I'm collecting? The, uh, the wax? This isn't the wax, is it? Somebody's in trouble. Somebody need needs the plucky squire. Or was that not a scream? The land of Mojo. Inkwood. Hell yeah. Oh yes, of course. The plucky squire leapt nimbly onwards. Now, this looked really quite precarious. Oh, I got this. Don't even worry about it. Jot took a deep breath. <sighs> and jumped! <laughs> he off he left. No! Oh! I was just about to say how good at platformers I am. But we, we all know by now that that's bullshit. Unless you're new around here. Then you should subscribe so that you know it's not. <laughs> ah! The top of Honey Peak! The view is incredible! Oh, no, it's ah! The top of Honey Peak! The view is incredible! I saw the monster on the end of the page and I thought that Pip was reacting to that. Now that right there is a massive out. That's Tome Tower, that is. Cool. Honey Badger! Whoa! That's a honey badger eating Benny B's honey! Be on your toes, Shot! A hungry hot honey badger can be really cranky! Hey! Mr. Honey Badger! Oh heck! Here we go! The honey badger seemed rather annoyed. Jot prepared Hell yeah. for a dust up. Hell yeah, this is the punch out section. Okay, teach me how to play, teach me how to play first. Okay, okay, eat a jab. Oh shit. Come on, oh fuck. Shit. Ow! 
Oh my god. I'm so ass. Oh, okay, I got you, I got you. I got you. Oh, oh. I got this. It's over. It's over. Come on, hit me with him. Hit me with Oh! 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 oh. Ah! Come on, bring it Oh, shit! Get him! Get him! It's over! It's over! Get him! Come on, you can do more than that. I've literally been doing double that damage. Ah! 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 You see him? Defeat the honey badger in a boxing the match. Was bested. Get out of here, Scram! The and don't come back. Fire. Triumphant. <laughs> ah! Back in the hive. Feels good. Yo, many thanks, Shot. You did me a solid. That honey badger was really messing with my beeswax. Anyhow, ga anyhow, gang, what brings you here? Moonbird sent us, Benny. He could really do with some of that beeswax if you have some spare. For sure, Pip. My man, I owe you. For sure, Pip, my man. I owe you guys. Here you go. Compliments to the Wiz. Huh? What's going on? What's with all this ominous darkness? Row. Down they fell. Is my whole adventure just trying to get back to the the wizard so that I can give him his wax? It was time to confer with Moonbeard. Oh man, that would have been a pretty cool adventure. <laughs> yep, it's Hump Grump. Hum Grump. All right. Yeah, it's Hump Grump. Hum Grump. All right, always up to the treacherous tricky, that one. There's something rather odd about that magic he used. And this is not usually how the story goes, you know. That is to say, um, forget about that. Ho rumph. This is a job for the plucky squire, Jot. Hum Grump is, a to is at Tome Tower. Head there and make sure that creepy little twerp doesn't cause any more trouble, any more bother. Trouble bother Sanford. Hello. Oh, she's adorable. Violet. Oh, she's adorable. Violet was a trainee witch with a love of art. And Jot's childhood friend. Uh, uh. <laughs> hey Jot, we've got another humgrum situation, huh? Moonbeard gave me the skinny. That weasel wizard is at Tome Tower. You kids head over there and Jot, put a stop to Humgrum's malarkey. I'll keep into that strange green. I'll look into that strange green magic and have a donut. But that's by but but that's by the by. Later. Goodbye and good luck. Although you never really need it, Jot. All right, no lie. I'm pumped that I'm going to get to see the plucky squire in action. Kapow! Lead the way, Jot. And so the plucky squire set off to Tome Tower. A spring and a step. And a gleam in his plucky eye. Hang on, I gotta kill some stuff. Deforestization and all that, you know what I mean? Oh, what's this? Yeah! yeah! 
Find an art scroll. You got a new piece of artwork. Press tab to show in gallery. Oh. Concept area mountains. Some early concepting of game environments, this would eventually become the green lands in the early chapters of the game. Oh! Oh! Wow! I gotta keep on the lookout for that stuff. Ooh! Ooh! What the? Pick up the gate. No, the gate. Ha ha ha. I see what I see what's going on here. I'm picking up what you're putting down. Oh, we gotta be very quiet. Never mind! Guns blazing! Guns blazing! Guns blazing! Guns blazing! <laughs> Nothing to it. You see that, Violet? That's the plucky squire in action. The gate swung open. Open says me! It always works every time. Nice, you always have a way with words, Jot. Sure. <laughs> what are these things I'm collecting? Are you an item shop? Greetings, brave warriors! My name is Martina. Nice to meet you. Your adventurers cut down fearsome enemy. You adventurers cut down fearsome enemies. Now I splash pre sl Fuck. <laughs> Let me show you what I have for sale. Oh, hell yeah. Sword throw badge. Oh, I could buy both of these. You want to test this move out? Sure. Ooh, we got a training yard. Well, now. Time to practice throwing your sword, chop. Oh fuck yeah! Oh yeah! Oh, it's it's over! <laughs> oh yeah! That's heat right there. Get going! If you want to keep training, check out the board. Otherwise, leave via the exit at the bottom of the page. Oh, uh, that's heat. It was lovely to make your acquaintance. Be sure to check in again. Next time we meet, I'll have new stock. You keep saving the land from bad business, and my business will save you from bad deals. So long, brave warriors. Wait, no. Oh, okay. Well, if it isn't... Cool. I gotta get those art scrolls. There's 50 of them? Oh, shit. Boxing minigame. You knew we wanted to feature a boxing minigame, but it took a while to land exactly, uh, land on exactly who your opponent would be. As it turns out, it wouldn't be a giant muscular duck. Jesus Christ. I'm glad it wasn't. Terrified of ducks. Kidding, by the way. Oops. All right, hell yeah. Ah, uh, it's, it's stuck now. Oh, that's so fire! Alright, moving on, moving on, moving on, moving on. Listen, if you're not vibing with this game by now, you just... You just... You weren't there. Oh! Yes, sir! Who are you? What are you, I guess? Find a glitch bird. There's 10 of those. You found a lost glitch bird. We will return to its homeland. Which is where exactly? To Tome Tower. Well, there it is. That mysterious ancient owl. All the knowledge of Mojo is supposed to be stored in there, you know? Whoa! Not sure the ground should be doing this. Nah, no, we're fucked. Ah! Oh, father. <laughs> Chapter 2. Tome oh. Tower. Oh, this game is lovely. Our heroes hung on to the cliff's edge by their fingernails. When suddenly... 
They were grabbed. By who? Who's here to save us? That's the homie. I can already tell. By who? That's the homie. Hey! By thrash. By thrash. No clue who that is, but he, he seems chill as hell. Was a mountain troll. And George and Violet's childhood friend. The trio had not been together for quite a while. Wow. And so were very happy to be reunited. Thrash! Oh boy! You really saved our skins! Are we happy to see you? Triple trouble together? Triple trouble together again! Hey! Oh, oh. <laughs> I'm just stoked I can fight you dudes! After all this craziness kicked off, I checked in with Moonbird! Moonbeard! He told me you were both headed to the Tome Tower! I figured I'd help you on your way! The path is wrecked, huh? Well, there's more than one route to Tome Tower! Let's get down to the ground! Uh, hey, where'd you go? Come back! Oh, so I'm thinking, again, since this game is chapter based, I kind of, I might do this one, one chapter per video as well. I've been giving you guys a lot of longer videos lately, so I'm, I'm feeling like, I'm feeling like the Plucky Squire is going to be a bit of a longer series with shorter videos. So I'm going to leave it off here for now, but let me know what you guys think. Do you want longer videos? Do you want like two, three chapters per video? What, what are you feeling? Because I, I, I've been giving you guys a lot of longer videos, but I don't know if you're actually, you know, enjoying those longer videos. We, we might shorten it up just a little bit. Just let me know. If you want to see my most recent video, I'll have that link somewhere around here. And then I'll have YouTube recommend whatever you watch next. Also link somewhere around here. I'm going to get out of here. I love you guys. Stay safe out there. Take it easy. And big squire out. <laughs> this game is so cute.